Good morning, you beautiful people. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day today. Welcome back to another episode of my Minecraft experience here in my single player world. We are back here in my single player world and we are gonna have a lot of fun today. Oh man, I love this place. I love this house. I love all the work I've done here. This is fantastic. And we are, uh oh, uh oh, my mouse is, uh, mouse is having some issues. I don't know if it's the mouse or if it's something else. Hello. Oh man. Okay. So last episode. Oh no. Stop it. What's it doing? Why? Uh, last episode we actually I think we finished the iron farm a little bit and this episode we are going to do a little bit more work on some projects. going to be really sort of an updated video but one of the projects I'm going to be kind of forefronting is this guy. Oh and you can see I've already put in this wall and I'll show you a little montage that I've been doing of, uh, of what I've been doing lately. but. If you are unfamiliar, let's see if we can't do some of this here. There we go. If you're unfamiliar, the whole idea of this world, of this place right here, this build specifically, this base, is to be a mountain village, obviously kind of cut off by a wall. Now this is the finished version of the wall. Now this is not going to be the same design everywhere. I'm experimenting. I do like the busyness of it. A lot of people don't, but I do. I think it, it looks interesting and I'll try to, I'll try not to be as busy as this, but I think it's a fun style to build. Plus I like having fun, but as you can see, there are like guide rails right here. There's wood involved and there's a whole bunch of different stuff. But what I need to do is I need to, or at least what I'm going to hopefully, oh, I hate my mouse. This is only happening when I'm recording. Oh, I hate it. <sighs> so what I've got to do yet, as you can see right here, I've got some walls like half built with the stone brick at the top and the smooth stone there and the wood. But when we come on over to this side, there's nothing. So that's what I'm going to do today. And I think I'm actually going to try to connect this guy to here all the way to over here, which could be really, really fun. And I think I have an idea. Go donuts, go. No, no, not going to happen. I have an idea of what I'm going to do. I'm going to kill this, this mouse. I'm going to, mm, mm -mm. I have an idea. I'm gonna get building, you guys are gonna see a nice little montage of me doing some work, and I think you guys will enjoy it. So, enjoy the little montage. My goodness, I don't think you guys are ready. I honestly, I don't think you are ready 
for the amount of progress that I have done off camera. In fact, I know you are not ready because I have done so much more than you will ever see. I don't even have time to wait for these leaves to, de uh, to decay. I just need to go. We just need to go. We're going to head on over here. We're going to drop off the logs here because we're going to need a lot more than that. But uh, anyway, you saw that little montage and uh, I have been always wanting to, I'd always been planning to continue on this little wall area you'll see right here. But without looking, without spoiling it, you guys have probably seen it already. There we go. This wall has been planned here since day one. This is why I chose this area to build in. I wanted an area, I wanted a wall going all around where I build. We'll continue out this way until about there or so, then go around. That's where I haven't really planned it out that much. I have an idea for what I want to go over there, which we'll get to later. But for all intents and purposes, we now have basically half of the wall up as you saw through that little montage i used so much stone i used a full double chest almost two full double chests full of stone to get this all done and dusted this is the first wall that i ever built this is the test wall i like to oh i like to say it's the test wall because that's the one i tested on it looks good and then we come over here and we have had this wall uh, before, but we kind of just gave it a little bit more polish, a little bit more uh, detail and stuff as we come all the way through this mountain. We're going to head on through here, and as you're going to see, aha, we have done a whole heck of a lot. Look at this. This is insane. Oh, and then we can come inside this mountain right here. We go on through, we come down, and look at it. Look at where we're at. Oh, this is so cool. This is a huge, huge build. And we are right here. Those are those houses. This is the fishing farm. This is the fishing farm. That is so epic. And we have a little tower here that I'm going to build. Oh, it's going to be so good. We have di another diagonal pathway going this way. Oh, beautiful people. Oh, beautiful people. It's so good. And then this can continue on. We are going to continue it all the way through here. Look at this. This and this wall was already kind of built before. But look at that. We need to get a better view of it. We are going to go all the way up here. Can we make it? Yeah, we can, baby. Awesome. Look at that. Oh, oh, it's so gorgeous. Let's let's get a better view. Let's get a better view with the shaders on because this is what's really really beautiful we'll load that in oh yes look at it oh i love the height difference there i love how oh i just love how it looks here with this entire build like this will load in thank you can you please thank you all of you focusing right there you have this wall that just continues around goes around goes around goes around and everything inside is like safe and nice and protected and oh I love it so much let's let's take a take a nap so we can see it during the day because uh, man that was that was a ton a ton of work <clears throat> but something that I did within that time is I turned on the music back on in Minecraft and I fell I have fallen back in love beautiful people sometimes we go through seasons of inspiration and not inspiration Oh, I love Minecraft. Just building it. It took ages. It took so long to build this all the way up because we'll go down here. This is a beautiful screenshot, by the way. We will, we will come down here and we'll take it like that and then maybe another one like so. A good, good screenshot for the episode. But uh, yeah, just the sheer amount of time it took to... Uh, I actually had a day off from work and you, you best believe this is exactly what I did right here. Uh, and this, honestly, I was thinking about, I was planning on actually, using B00's castle pieces uh, to build this, because that's kind of like exactly the style that I have going on here. And I think that's going to be a really, really cool one. I think that's going to be really good. It's going to fit really nicely here. And I think it's going to be just like the, the, I love the thought, I love the idea, the concept of building a big castle and being able to actually functionally use it. Like, 
every place has its piece, every place has its place, you know, every place has a reason for it to be there. And having this like a spiral staircase upwards here to defend off guards or to guard this, to defend off attackers from this side, it's awesome. It's so, so awesome. And what I plan on doing here, uh, just kind of keeping with, I don't know, whatever weird lore I have, obviously it's Minecraft, so it's not that big of a deal. But, um, obviously this this wall goes through this mountain right which well one it looks cool but two it kind of leaves us open for attacking on this side right like someone could just climb up this mountain and just get through the wall well right here or down over here somewhere i plan on building a guard tower where again you can just shoot all of the incoming attackers you can get another view of the wall from here and just make sure we're all protected i think it looks great i think it looks so so fantastic uh it took to do these wooden posts whatever you you want to call these um all the way from where was it all the way from there just that one side all the way through here to there nine stacks ten no twelve twelve stacks twelve stacks of wood just to do that little section it's crazy people it's just so crazy it's like 64 blocks tall which is like a stack per row it's insane it's so insane but there is something even more insane i've done i was just playing and i was watching some some mumbo jumbo i was catching up on what he was doing on the hermitcraft server and i saw him build something i saw him build a cheeky little potato or, or pumpkin and melon farm specifically this pumpkin and melon farm ladies and gentlemen this is the most ridiculous build this is the most ridiculous farm i have ever seen in minecraft that is not hyperbole that is fact this thing is insane this thing is going to make us rich and it's gonna do it today this literally took maybe 20 minutes to build like I had to throw together the pistons and everything but other than that it's just dirt some mine carts and redstone like it's so stupidly cheap so stupidly simple you put it up to a clock right here this is just a clock that I know how to make and you just oh it's just so simple and it's so easy so I have afk'd overnight overnight i have afk'd right from from about 11 o'clock last night to about 9 10 o'clock this morning and this is what we got uh-huh mm-hmm uh-huh yep oh boy look at it look at it it's crazy it's crazy beautiful people and let me tell you this little secret, little back, 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 uh, what do you call it? Backstage stuff. I, I, I made this a couple days ago. So I also AFK'd last night during work. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Beautiful people. This is the easiest thing I've ever done. And it's made me the most rich. This is crazy. We... This is crazy. And it doesn't stop there. I was thinking, you know, this would be fantastic for trading, right? Because that's obviously what we want to do with this, right? So there is uh, actually, if you remember from episode, what, like two? Literally two. If you go back to episode two, please don't. It's just really cringeworthy. Um, there was, I found a skeleton spawner right here. And I have just literally thrown in water I'm saying literally like a teenage girl I've just thrown in water I've moved them down a bit and I have given them a uh, a magma block to stand on which we can see if we go through back over here and we'll go through here go 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 donuts um, I have put them over here and there's the magma block they stand on. They fall down and they just take damage until they die. Their stuff spits out. And down here, yep. Uh-huh. Oh yeah. You believe it. Bam. That is just one night. That's just one night of AFK time. 
And like I said before, I didn't do just one night of AFK time. No, no, no. I did a lot. I mean, a lot of AFK time. Look at this. We have eight stacks of bone blocks now. Plus, like, so much more. Each of that is a stack. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eighteen. We have 26 stacks. We have almost a full, we have almost a full double chest. No, no, almost a full chest of simply bone blocks. You know what bone blocks are good for? Holding bone meal. You know what bone meal is really good for? Fully automatic um, pumpkin, melon, and wheat farms, right? Right. If only there were a simple, easy design where we could actually just put pumpkins or, or potatoes and carrots in here. This is it. This is the thing. If you've seen the bakery server, this is the machine. You get this, you get uh you get bone meal, you put it there, and it's just like mad. It's just like mad. Oh my goodness, let's get farming. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Sorry, 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 everybody. As you can probably tell, this is a very long episode. I can ramble on like nobody's business. We don't got no time to trade this episode. So that is going to be the start of the next episode. <sighs> it's just so satisfying. But uh, anyway, that will do us for today. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. We've got so much potential here. None of this is permanent, guys. None of this is permanent. This is just stuff I threw together to like AFK over a couple nights. If this thing kept running every single time I played this, I would not have enough storage room. It's just crazy. So that is going to give us a fantastic place. Uh, I think I want to build the uh, pumpkin slash melon farm now. I think I want to do that. I think that's something. Hello. That I am interested in because uh, it's just kind of. It's just kind of there, like we need a storage spot for it anyway. So what I was thinking about having, um, I'm getting ahead of myself, I'm too excited. What I was thinking about doing was having a big open area, sort of like the wheat, but a little bit more natural, not so much like a stand, more so like a field of wheat or a field of pumpkins and melons. And then the secret underground area would be this absolutely crazy machine. I might have two of them too, or something similar, uh, parallel, uh, reflective on both sides. But anyway, that's going to do us for today. Next episode, we are going to get some trading going on. And my goodness, we are going to get rich. Let's go, baby. Thank you guys so much for watching. And until the next absolutely gorgeous Minecraft morning, I will catch up with you guys later. And as always, stay beautiful.